Howdy folks, coming at you live. We got um, this Desert King and Moon and Star uh, crossbreed here. And I call it that because a few years ago, me and my wife got married. Our grandmother had gave some seeds that she had had passed down to her, which was pretty awesome. And that just said yellow meated watermelon seeds. And there was probably 200 in there. So we planted them and they come up this pea green rind like so so i started researching yellow meated watermelon it kind of looked like what they say is a desert king so it's like they grow good out in arkansas and really heat tolerant and uh so that's what i started deeming these desert king but they were yellow meated well, one year i planted moon and star and desert king and saved the seeds and the next year it come out there was some uh, Desert King with yellow spots, but they were yellow meated. They were still yellow meated, but they had the little yellow stars on there, which I thought was, yeah, that's cool, man. I'm saving these seeds. So the next year I planted them, and there's a video on my YouTube, Desert King Surprise. Well, anyways, we bust one of these yellow meated watermelons, and it's got this pink flesh. But the only thing different than a moon and star, uh, you, as you may know, they've got a high sugar content and they've got a high seed content. So they're really good melons, but I don't consider the moon and star my favorite, mainly because it seems like there's so many seeds you got to dig. But this has the, the traditional, um, it, to me, it's got larger seeds than most melons, as you can see. You know, pretty decent size. And that's one reason why I like it. The taste is not the sweetest melon on earth, but it's crisp and it's wonderful. Like I said, this one might be one day over on texture. A little mushy, but it's still pretty dang crisp. Sugar content is not super high, but we've had a lot of rain this summer. And I planted melons late, but we've still had pretty late rain for August. But anyways, if somebody wants to throw out a name for it, we could name it. I'm all, I'm all ears. I call it that Desert King Moon and Star Cross, but that's kind of long name. So, but if anybody would want some seeds from this, hit me up. Shoot me a dress, and I'll uh, send you some. And I promise they won't be mystery seats from China. Peace.